the idea bored me stiff. I wouldn't go if I could to anywhere again. I wouldn't go if my life depended on it. What are you getting so emotional about, Miss Kelly? What's the matter with you? You may be a peculiar man with funny clothes, but he knows how to act. His manners were perfect. I saw you give him that googly-eyed stare. I didn't miss that. He wouldn't sit down till I sat down. He told me I was lovely and called me dear. I would have lived with him if you were going. Oh, of course you would. And look at him. All he does is hang around bars. He doesn't work. And all that courty bowing and getting up whenever a girl makes a move. Why, he's as outdated as a cast iron deer. But no, you'd go out with him <coughs> and you'd let him flatter you up. You're a wonderful girl, Miss Kelly. Now let me tell you something. Ah, Dr. Sanderson, Miss Kelly. Oh, yes, yes Doctor. Tell the dog that a groom will care for you around my prize dahlias along the fence by the main road. We'll be ready for cutting next week. Yes, Doctor. Oh, uh, the issue with the woman in the big white rabbit has a uh, back and smoothed over? Oh, yes, I just spoke with her brother, and he was quite reasonable. <laughs> I've had many patients out here see animals before. I've never before had a patient with an animal that large. Yes, Doctor. She called me Harvey. Harvey. Unusual name for an animal of any kind. Harvey's a man's name. I've known several men in my time named Harvey, but never an animal whatsoever with that name. This case has an interesting page, Doctor. Yes, Doctor. I'll now go upstairs with you and look in on this patient. Maybe that we can use my formula 977 on her. I will give you instructions in prescribing the treatment, Doctor. Thank you, Doctor. <laughs> and uh, now, what is that hatch of notes doing on that table over there? Who's it? Oh, I don't know, Doctor. Is it Mr. Dowd who's telling? He had his hat on when he came in, Doctor. Perhaps it belonged to one of the relatives of the patients? Here, hand me the hat. And maybe some kind of identification. <laughs> What's this? What's this? There's two sure. holes cut in the crown of this hat. See? That's strange. Huh. Something bad. Here, you can come up. Come away, get out of here. Oh, hello, Dr. Chumper. Ah, oh, there you are, Wilson. How is every little old thing? Uh, fine, Wilson. Thank you. Fine. Uh, now, listen. Somebody's gonna have to give me a hand with this Simmons thing. She's terrible. Order a restraining jacket or something. Forget about somebody, did you? Well, I got a post off all by myself. Well, we're going upstairs to see this patient right now, Wilson. Oh, she's in the hydro club. I just. Oh my god, I left the water coming off! 